it's MC here. I'm from Monica. And see you soon. This is my first video ever on YouTube because in the last one I was too busy with schoolwork and everything, so I didn't have time. But I did help, right? Yeah, she did help editing and filming the video, so we had a really great experience. And today we're back with a another video, which is what's in a troll bag. Yes, because we're going to New York for four days. Yay! Yay. We're so excited right now. So yeah, don't forget to subscribe. So you like this video and you have any question, don't hesitate to comment below. So yeah, let's get started. Bye. This is our two luggages, and mine is um, petite. Um, my sister's is really big. So let's see what's inside. So in the small luggage, um, there's not much because I'm just going to New York for four days. So I just bring some clothes with me and this is my big vest in case um, the weather is really cold and in this pink bag right here I have my underwear I won't show you guys so um, in this um, makeup bag so this is the beauty bag we are carrying with us it's from JAR and we really like it because it's really convenient um, to bring all the stuff that we need so yeah let's see what's inside First, we have our BB cream. Um, it has SPF of 25 in it. We really like it because it gives a light to medium coverage depending on how many layers you put on your face. It can be a little bit drying for those who have um, dry skin type. And then I have my um, favorite blush of all time. I use the Clarins one in the color um, Rose Pastel. It's just a really nice like pinchy pink color as you can see and then uh, this Annabelle blush is my sister's favorite it's a really it's a really pretty pink mixed purple blush it also has shimmers in it and it's pretty pigmented and then this is my sister's elf contouring blush and bronzing powder she only used the bronzer one because um, it's really pigmented and it looks pretty on her and then moving on to this translucent powder, it's her Rimmel Stay Matte Pressed Powder. She really like it. It helps for controlling her oil. And then moving on to lipsticks and lip glosses, I'm just going to take them out. This is the Maybelline one. I'm sure you have heard of this one. It's the color Pink Please. It's just a really nice baby pink color. It's my sister's favorite. And then this is my Clarins lipstick and it's just a really nice pink mix um, purple color. I don't know if you can see it through the camera but yeah it's pretty pigmented and I like it. And then we have another Clarins lipstick and this is a really nice um, pink color. Um, it's not a as pigmented as I thought it will be but if you play with the layers you can have the color that you want and then uh, this is our girl in lip gloss it's just a really nice pink with um, gold shimmers in it and it's the color um, rose temptation the only thing we dislike about this one is that it's all a bit sticky but it's still okay and um, this is my sister's favorite lip balm it's the lip seal and this is my favorite uh, Lancome um, Jelly Lip Balm. <clears throat> it's just amazing. It hydrates. It gives just a little tint of um, color on your lips. And so, yeah, I really like it. And then moving on to mascaras. Um, this is the Lash Serum from L'Oreal Paris. I like it so much because it makes my lashes fuller, thicker, and I have less fallout. I apply it every morning and every night before going to sleep. And this is our favorite May, um, waterproof mascara. It's the Maybelline One, the Full Seas Volume Express. And then this is our favorite, favorite mascara of all time. It's the L'Oreal Paris Telescopic Carbon Black. It holds the curls, um, it gives volume, and it's just amazing. The only thing we dislike about this product is that it's not waterproof, but it doesn't smudge that easily. And we like it so much that we have a backup of it. And then this is our Clinique palette. It just has two shades of eyeshadows in it. And this is 
uh, Oriel Elf um, eye primer and this is the Dolly Wink eyeliner um, this is my sister's um, concealer in one side you have the concealer and in the other side you have the highlight and this is our um, eyelash curler and uh, it's, it's amazing it's from Bella brush um, our old one broke so we had to grab another one and just, this just works wonderful and then of course we have a hairbrush with a mirror moving on to our last product this is the Sila smudge but um, this is the tester size by the way and I really like this product I have used it for um, six months now and it's amazing it doesn't smudge that easily and it stays for a really long time and then here we have our very essential brushes so yeah that's basically it so here's my luggage and in this black bag I just put my socks in it and in the other one it's my underwear and here's my clothes, pajamas and in this Dior bag I put inside my skincare stuff and um, in this one we put our charger stuff for our cell phone, iPod and everything and here's my cream, it's the Nivea soft one and my Clinidone one but I'm not going to bring these huge bottles, I'm going to put them in small little containers later on because I just put them inside so I don't forget to do it. And here's my shampoo, it's the Yves Rocher, the nourishing shampoo one. I used to use the Garni one but it's too dry for winter time. So I chose this one, the nourishing shampoo one and I really like it because it doesn't dry my, my hair and yeah, I really like it. And then here's my lotion. It's the Avena one. I really, really, really like it. My sister and I, we really like this one. And here on the these cream, here's my sandals. And yeah, let's see what's in my skincare bag. So here's my skincare bag. I just used this Dior Beauty one because it's really big so it can hold a lot of things inside. So yeah, let's open it. Um, first, we can see my deodorant. I really like this Nivea Dry Confidence one because first, it smells really good and also it keeps my sweet at bay, so that's a really good thing. And also, it doesn't leave a white thingy on on my shirt when I'm wearing a black shirt. So yeah, I really like it. And my sister saw that it worked really well, so she bought the same thing, but we put her yeah, her name on it because yeah, we don't want to mistake each other's. And then we have this Shiseido sunscreen. I really, really like this one because it's not grease, greasy and doesn't leave a white cast on my face. And yeah, I really like it. And then we have our Garnier Fructis Triple Nutrition Leave-In Conditioner. And yeah, because during winter time, our hair gets really dry, so this stuff works really well. I really like it. And then we can find our Cetaphil Daily Facial Moisturizer with SPF 15 because even during winter time, you have to put like a moisturizer or even sunscreen because yeah, it protects from the rays, and it's really good. And then here's the last thing. And it's our Neutrogena Moisture All Free Moisturizer. And yeah, it's just a basic moisturizer that we like. So yeah, 